Hey, what's up? I'm Al Cox. I make games, play games, and everything in between. And today we are checking out Drone Escape Legacy. This game was built with BuildBox 3. It basically took the float template in BuildBox and added a character. And I'm not sure what more additions they made. So let's take a look. So you just play. And so you tap. And... Okay, okay, so you can move. Okay, so it's not a tap, it's a moving game. You know, I don't know where people get assets from in BuildBox 3. I know there's some videos where they talk about places you can get assets. Uh, that was an interesting death. New best, 14. Okay, I think. Because wherever I touch the screen, like if I move up, but then I touch down here, and the character automatically starts at the very middle, like that. All right, now let's do it again without dying so much. Uh, I was doing so well. Do I go here? I right, do, cool. Okay, but it has to be very specific. This angle view is interesting. I I feel like I want to look at it like this when I play it. A lot of this, I believe, is just in the template. Oh shit! These balls look cool. Ooh, just random three-dimensional objects falling from the sky. This is to be expected, I guess. Oops, I was not paying attention. Good. Random objects. I don't know if I'm supposed to get that or not. I assume just avoid everything and try to get a new high score. Ah, shit. Definitely the angle is interesting. I don't know if I could play this game for too long without trying to look on the other side of it. Gameplay is pretty cool. There's that issue with the tapping that I talked about, which means basically you just have to always keep your finger on a character or be prepared for what happens if you let go but then again maybe you can use that somehow in the game you got your main menu screen this that was cool it took the current screen that the game over happened and just put the menu ui on top of it so wait, i'm gonna try one more time see if i can't uh, See, see if I can't beat my high score. Again, need to not pick up my finger. I feel like the score is just based on distance. I'm not sure why I'm getting... Unless these help. Which I don't think they do much. And I got a new high score. Yeah, so that is a thing I can get that was This is awesome. So this is like an invincibility plus speed. I feel like I just got another one of these and something happened. My new best and game over. If you're looking to play a BuildBox 3 games, here's one of them. There's a couple more out there. They're all very in the beginning phases of becoming like a real game when it comes to objectives, goals, levels, layers. This looked pretty cool. I don't know if that angle would work for me. I definitely, if I was gonna make a game, use different angles. The, the gameplay was exciting. Check it out, links down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.